How you doing? Tad Frank again. The number eight video in our top 15 video countdown is Brian. You know, people put a lot of time and effort into this. Brian really thought out, staged a kind of a fake mock talk show, and you know, kind of showed his multiple talents. So the number eight video is Brian. And by the way, Brian, we can't sing. It's The Tonight Show with Brian Ferrara. Tonight's guest, on Team Season 1 winner, Brian Ferrara. With music by the Brian Ferrara Band. And now, ladies and gentlemen, your host, Brian Ferrara. Tonight show. Uh, we have a great show tonight. Uh, we have Tom Keen's season one winner, Brian Ferrara. In fact, I'm so excited about this interview. I'm going to skip my normally hilarious monologue, get right to it, and, uh, and let's do that. So, uh, Brian Ferrara, man, take us away. guest. He is Tom Team's season one winner. You know him as audition number 100494. Let's bring out Brian Ferrara. Uh, great job on Tom Team. Really good stuff. What were you doing before the show? Tell us a little about you. Okay. Uh, well, um, I was just a 26-year-old attorney living in New York City. You know, just a regular guy, not an aspiring actor or model. Obviously, <laughs> I read about Tontine on the internet, figured I'd give it a shot, uh, here I am. Okay, so you said you read about Tontine on the internet, then what, take us through casting? Okay, uh, like I said, just read about it online, went to the open casting at South Street Seaport. There I met the producers, answered some questions, even won a t-shirt, so I was winning things right off the bat, which is pretty cool. Uh, a couple weeks after that, got an email about the $10,000 YouTube challenge. Um, not too good with videos, so I just gave them what they asked for. Um, something about me, I was creative, entertaining, hopefully. Um, you know, I'm sure the producers got tired of watching the same video over and over again. <laughs> um, you know, someone just bragging to the camera, or pleading, or using their kids, uh, showing glamour shots, or even something disgusting. So I uh, just tried to give them what they wanted. We actually have a highlight reel from your submission. Uh, Want to talk us through? Oh, okay, sure. Well, I like to just hang out in my backyard sometimes, so... Oh, this actually... this gets kind of gross, sorry. I also like to dabble in the martial arts, so I... I'm, I'm self-taught. So I, I figured I'd show them some of my training exercises that I developed, and I'd show them my moves. I also like to sing. I figured I should show off some other talents. So, uh, I, I mean, I don't think I'm that good, but uh, I'll let you. I'll let you be the judge. Take a listen. Join Tom Team. Fifteen keys, fifteen players, one will win. Join Tom Team. Don't you know possessions, everything? Join Tom Team. Ferrara will be your first champion. Join Tom Team. No one knows what network it is on. Join Tom Team. These are YouTube spoofs if you did no join Tom Team. Just watching some NASCAR here. Garner, put on your leg brace. I don't even know who Garner is. Wanted to end with some drama. And then that's it. A few weeks later, I was on the show. Why do you think the producer saw you as a good choice for Tom Team? Well, I feel like I'm a well-rounded mix of everything they were asking for in a contestant. Uh, they wanted mentally adept. I uh, gave them a great education and background. 
Yeah, I've heard about those Yale educations. They're pretty good. <laughs> yeah, me too. Um, what else? They said they wanted physically adept. I played hockey, lacrosse, football all my life. Actually, yeah, that, that ties in with the competitive aspect that the producers wanted. Um, and ask anyone, I'm as competitive as they come. Whether it's foot races or board games, I just love to compete. I, I mean, I hate to lose, but I love to compete. Actually, that was a problem with uh, you know getting older. Um, I like to still play sports, but it, you know if I get excited about uh, scoring a goal or or uh, winning now, I'm just that over competitive jerk. <laughs> I don't get it. So Tom Team came along and it was great because I actually got to play for something that was awesome. What else? Uh, oh yeah, I love reality TV and game shows. In fact, I even earned my way onto a show last year called Gold Rush. Yeah, that's where you blew it when you were about to win hundred thousand dollars, wasn't it? Wait a second, I can explain that. If anyone watched it, or I mean, if you want, you can go and watch it on the internet. It's out there. Uh, you know, you can see for yourself. The first two rounds, I, I dominated, and those are the ones that actually required brains and skill. Um, it was the uh, the final round, which ended up being a guessing game at the end. All right, all right, let's move on then. Uh, once you found out you were going to be on Tom Team, how'd you prepare? What'd you do? And once I got the call, I knew I had to step up my training. They didn't have much time, so I went with a tried and true method that I've seen work hundreds of times. Albeit in the movies, I made a montage, so I actually brought a clip with me. Okay, let's take a look. Remind everyone of what's going on And with every shot show a little improvement To show it what would take too long That's called a montage Rocky had a montage, montage. montage. In any sport if you want to go From just a beginner to a pro You need a montage Tell us about your time on Tom Team. It was a grueling hundred days. Uh, being away from family and friends that one was never fun. Uh, but it was worth it, uh, obviously. <laughs> we went to all seven continents. Uh, this is a kid that I had never even been out of the United States before the show. And here I was traveling the world. So that was exciting. It was challenging, but it was exciting. Um, and actually the challenges were, were crazy. They were a lot of fun. They were crazy. Things I've never done before in my life. We actually have some footage from one of them. Okay. Oh, this is the solve the Rubik's Cube ball skydiving challenge. Man, this is a tough one. That's me. Uh, in order to get your parachute to deploy, you have to solve the cube. So, you didn't get the cube, you didn't get the parachute. Fortunately, I got the hang of it right here at the end, and you know, the tension first. Uh, actually, with the guy who, uh, who finished last, his funeral is next Thursday. <laughs> Short on time, so uh, tell us what's next for you. Okay, well, what else? I'm um, I'm in a movie. Actually, now I have to show the trailer, so uh, check it out. It's called Tom Team the Movie. It's coming out soon.
that's our show. I'd like to thank Ryan Pilar, our guest, audition number 100494. Everyone else that helped the production. And uh, stay tuned for some other crappy YouTube videos coming up next. Good night.